What's happening? Got a lot of nice reds. We're in that magic window still. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I just seen a little fish in there, dude. And he was like, his fin was sticking out the top. He was like, right through them rock there. The predator fish must be using that as a trap to catch a little fish, but that's what it looked like. Like there was a bigger one chasing a smaller one. It's pretty cool. Yeah, look at that. See, that's weird because look. Right here, I see blue. But for some reason, those clouds are so freaking iridescent. It's appearing that it's freaking, it's pixeling out. Mm -hmm. Got my freaking stick here. But little bird friends! It's lovely to be here with you once again thank you for your company I mean, the easy sleazy side of town has its perks. Definitely. Oh yeah, the magic window, full of facts. Freaking bug just bounced, bounced off my neck. Uh. At least it didn't bite me. Uh. I don't care. It's always time well spent. No wasted energy out here, buddy.
I love this shit. At least nobody freaking hated and tore my thing down here. definitely a spot you wouldn't want to freaking hang out for very long because look <laughs> the mosquitoes are so bad right now mosquitoes and gnats Ooh, you gotta sacrifice man for your therapy you gotta tune them all out even your feet hurt. You got to gear up one more time. And go. It's a good investment. Invest in yourself. Sometimes investing in yourself is investing in others. And just the environment. I love these little nooks and crannies here, man. So, people come at me trying to make assumptions that I'm up to some kind of something bad you got me totally you're reading me totally the wrong way maybe you should try it maybe you wouldn't be so fucking nosy you know everybody's ass making assumptions and shit fucking people's lives over man Cause your ego and your pride sometimes the greatest form of respect and showing love is just let people be be amongst them and just let them be Besides, this is a fucking green light district, man. There's a fucking special unit of cops that are constantly surveilling this place. So, look. <laughs> you can't get too crazy. Anyway, even if you wanted to, that'd just be dumb. You'd be asking for it, so. Believe me. I do things with reserve and discretion. But sometimes I let my hair down. You know what I'm saying? Do a little bit. I ain't doing nothing wrong. I ain't trying to hurt nobody. I ain't trying to harm anybody. No pain, no gain, man. So if you see me out here getting it in, dawg. Like, look. Pampering yourself. And being afraid, man, to freaking... Look. That'll get you hurt and killed. And, uh, dead. <laughs> so... I don't know, man. No pain, no fucking gain. So don't take the shit the wrong way. Don't make assumptions and shit. See, I don't know. It seems to me like professional people like over there 
and that hospital and police are taught to disregard everything you say and draw all their own conclusions. It's totally a subjective way of thinking, man. Subjective. They're taught totally subjective. Sometimes you gotta take a step back from yourself, even. And look, you gotta listen to other people, know what's going on. But if your own freaking thoughts are getting in the way of that, man, and you're freaking, you're basically projecting and deflecting and imprinting uh, and, uh, you know, you're, uh, you're doing all those narcissistic things, buddy. You're professionally a trained narcissist professional. <laughs> I hope your mother's proud of you. You know what I'm saying? I mean, because, hey, they're also taught to be fake as fuck to cover that up. And keep it, you know. Keep it confined to their narcissistic safe haven. And then keep everybody else in this, like... Oh, I'm just doing my job bubble. Nothing to see here. No, I get it, buddy. I get it. I understand where you're at. I can put myself in your shoes. That shit just would eat me the frick up, man. That shit would bother me. But, you know, hey, I ain't everybody. Different strokes, different fucking folks. So, hey. I'm sympathetic to the point where, you know, I, I wouldn't mind to be you. Feel for you, buddy. I don't know what the hell that was that just ran by. If those were rabbits. But, look, there's a vixen out here somewhere, man. You can hear. See, they got a different, they told they got a different sounding call. Than a male uh, fox freaking call. Freaking. So, I witnessed it uh, for myself the other night. So, yeah, there's foxes out here. You just don't never see them. But you can hear them at night if you know what you're listening for. But, yeah, uh, listen, uh, a male fox mating call is the strangest. Sound you'll ever hear. It's like a screech bark. That bug tried to fly in my belly. You don't want to be there, bud. That means you're dead. In my body, you'll be seeing that as protein, buddy. But, oh, fucking ass. Anyway, I'm gonna cut this off, man. Just getting some sky watch in while I got. While the. Look at that Pac Man. Pac Man eating a little ball. Oh my gosh, I gotta take a whiz. Alright, y'all. Much love. Take care. God bless. Safe travels. Till next time. Much love and peace.